If you want to find the easiest way to make money online, come to InvestFest and check out the Ticket Plug. Come join our ticket resale community. Don't sleep on us in the vendor marketplace. We are one of the headliners, but we have a life-changing opportunity for those coming to learn new ways to invest and build a business. It's time to learn how to sell tickets online and never in the streets. It's the Ticket Plug at booth number 421 at the vendor marketplace. Click the link at the top line of the description for more. All right, so this is Kai Sinet and I Show Speed. They did a video game marathon for apparently two straight days. And for whatever reason, they filmed this scene of them in a shower together. And um, the first thing I do when I see videos like that, I jump right to the comment section to see if I'm off base on what I'm thinking, right? And again, these are two of the biggest you know, um, social media inflows, not just black in the world. I mean, they both command huge followings. They travel over the world and they're influential. Now, Kaisenet, maybe last year sometime, you know, he caught a lot of backlash for doing the, the glorification, as some people call it, of the jail scene where he was in there with his buddies. And he made it seem like it was a glorified thing and a fun place to be. Um, and, you know, we talked about it. And we, we, we just said, all right, look, he's young. And both of these guys are very, very young, right? But this is what we talk about. And we've interviewed a lot of celebrities, a lot of artists, a lot of movie stars. And some of them pretty much came clean and said, look, it's certain things that I was asked to do that I did not want to do. Like, you mean me bending over and letting another man do whatever or me getting in the shower with another guy? And stuff like that. Like, there's thousands of other funny things that I can do besides that. So why do you want me to do this? So I question, why did these two brothers do this? Was it, as they call it, a humiliation ritual? Was it somebody's dark, twisted fantasy? Did they get paid? I'm sure they got paid. Like, that, that they just do this for free. They got paid, but who in their right mind, what producer, what so-called mastermind in their right mind would say, you know what, get in the shower together and not only be in the shower together, right? Start trying to act like you're really trying to get at this dude. And, and, and I, I'm saying, I'm reading the comments, people are like, well, you know, when you're in jail, when you're in high school, but yeah, you know, the, it's, the difference is you in there and the thing is, you don't, you ain't looking down to somebody else's junk, Right? You know to wash yourself up and keep it moving, right? And even in some jails, let's say if it has, you know, one shower, they going it could be, it might be six shower heads, but we going to wait until that person gets out, then I go in. That person gets out, then I go in. That person gets out, then I go in. Now, you got instances, maybe in military or however things go, where it's, you know, multiple men taking showers or whatever the case may be. There's unwritten rules to that, though. It's like nobody's coming up trying to play with you and mess with you and do no weird shit like that. It's you in there, you're getting your shit done, you're getting up out of there. So for people trying to justify that, though, that's not how it works, right? So, look, it's a respect thing, man. And if you had to ask me, you put me on the spot, I would have to say from my history of, of observing Hollywood, the music industry, and the way that black men in particular are depicted, it seems like over 80%, maybe I'm stretching a little bit, 70% of black actors, especially influencers now, are put in precarious, strange situations for whoever's self-aggrandizement. Like, whatever's funny to them in our culture should be taboo. Like, no, just, we just don't do that. We just, that's just something we just don't do. You feel me? It's taboo, but it seems like the people that are in charge, these guys, you know, I know for Kai, he signed to a multi-billion dollar company. I'm sure the other guys signed. So, you know, these guys are getting things that they have to do. And they're being told that they have to do this stuff, right? And if they decline, who knows? But that'll be like, I'm, I have something like for me. A regular man, that's I'm just not doing that, bro. Like, could we do something else? 
Like, it's, it's I, I, I can make something else up funnier than getting in the shower with another dude and act like he's trying to get at me. And then the kids see this, right? And, and what kind of message is it sending to the Because remember, look at the demographic. Now, it's one thing if you're talking about a demographic 35 to 60. You're talking about a demographic. This is probably the most important point I'm hit on. A demographic of 10-year-olds, 9, 10-year-olds to maybe 25, 26, maybe 30. Kids are watching these dudes carry on like this. So, look, they're young. Um, I'm not giving them a pass. I would just want to know why, right? I would just want to know why. Like, well, what? I honestly, I kind of expected from the show Speed Dude, Kai said, I'm like, wow, dog. Like, but then again, look, this is how this industry is. But I'm going to digress. I'm going to fall back. Please let me know what y'all think in the comment section. Am I going too far with this? Am I thinking too far out the box with it? Is it a humiliation ritual? Do you think it's, what do you think, the emasculation agenda? What is it? I'm going to hear your thoughts because you are the most important, the lifeblood of this channel and of the YouTube ecosystem. It is the people, the people that engage, the people that comment on the videos. Leave a comment below. Let me know what y'all think. And um, be sure to hit the thumbs up button on the video as well. And share this joint. Go ahead, share it, share it, share it to Twitter, share it to Facebook. And with that being saying, I'm out. Peace.